Okay, a shakedown is so you learn what works and what don't work. And I learned a buff and eyeglasses do not work together because my glasses are fogging up and I can't see a thing. So I guess I'm gonna have to wear contacts when it is cold enough for a buff. How you doing, honey? I'm doing fine. You can't see me smiling, but I promise I am. All righty. Out here in this Arctic blast we're having. I would say another lesson I learned was one layer of gloves, even though they're possum down, is not sufficient for this kind of cold. So I will be looking for another layer of gloves. So since my first pack didn't work out for me, I had ordered the women's Art Call 60 liter, but it really just was too big. The back of my head hit the frame, couldn't even raise my head up to look at the sky. So it just didn't work. So I've been on the hunt for the right backpack for a short tor torso. Ended up at REI and they were most helpful. So it seems as though the Osprey Asia was my pick and they didn't have it in the extra small. So we ordered it, but that meant coming on the shakedown without a sufficient backpack. So I just loaded up about 18 pounds in like a book bag. I think Jan Sport is all I had on hand. So no, uh, nothing to bear the weight on the hips, just straight from the shoulders. And our first day out, uh, that got pretty rough. So I'm excited, anticipating my Osprey. Can't wait to get it. It was really comfortable. And these Ultra Lone Peaks are so comfortable. I am really loving the wide toe box. That's what I got. And my husband got the same Ultra Lone Peak. I think six is what they're called. And man, he is loving his too. So definitely a winner on those and just really enjoying this small shakedown, being out in the woods, being in the cold. It is just fantastic. Okay, see you later. So pretty out here. I'm even enjoying the cold temperatures. This trail I'm on is called Frog Pond Trail. A very short trail, but absolutely beautiful. So the shakedown hike didn't go quite as planned, but that's okay. Lesson number one is to learn to be flexible. Yes, I'm near a road. Unfortunately, I'm not deep in the forest. 
But anyway, so who would have planned on an Arctic blast? So we've just been doing day hikes here in the Georgia mountains. And here we have the Frog Pond Trail. I don't see any frog, frogs in this cold weather. And did I say I'm having a blast? Loving it, every minute of it, even the cold. So this is day three of our shakedown. Uh, we are in Georgia mountains. Uh, we're kind of combining uh, a Christmas vacation with the family with our shakedown. Uh, so the first day of hiking, my husband got out and hiked in seven degree weather um, with wind gust. And then the second day, I think we hiked in 20, 20 something degree weather. And today we are a toasty 34 to 36. So honestly, the cold has really not been a problem at all, other than my fingers. My fingers have been cold, but really have enjoyed the hikes. There goes my girlfriend, heading down to AT. On our shakedown. On your shakedown. Are you coming? Yeah, wave bye. Keep on going. All right. You're doing good. I'll be doing better when I get my pack. Okay, then. And today, we got on trail at Unicoi Gap. So, we have really enjoyed these beautiful woods in this very crisp air probably about 32 degrees right now and just loving it look at the beautiful mountains all around how you doing honey i'm doing fine you can't see me smiling but i promise i am all righty out here in this arctic blast we're having Uh-huh. Uh-huh. I ain't fat. It's the belt that's pulling it all in. Uh-huh. On your mark. Get set. Go. And he's off. <laughs> Am I there yet? And yes, even though I am on the trail. That is the traffic you hear. So, still not deep, deep into the forest, but I'm having a blast. Oh my goodness, I'm having a blast. Give me more. <laughs>